Uh, the 430 got away from me. The clutch was so hard to press in. And I was literally climbing up the back tires of that tractor, and Scott's sitting there screaming something, shaking his fist at me like that was going to stop it all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was trying to use my power, man. Hey, everybody, soybean farmer. Well, you saw Cousin and I working on that uh, planter. We had it hooked behind this little Ford tractor right here. And we got it set up and got it lined up and got everything working right on it. So now the next thing to do is you see Cousin coming across the field out there. Maybe you see him. Yeah, there he is. That's the little John Deere 1020 tractor. Been on this farm uh, since about 1965. Great little tractor. But what we want to do now is we want to move the tires in on that little tractor to match the uh, tire spacing on this Ford tractor. Ford gives you two options, wide and narrow. That's it, there's no in between. That little John Deere uh, that Cousin's bringing over here has that wonderful John Deere option of infinitely variable. So we're gonna change it to uh, match up with the Ford here so we can plant with either tractor or spray with either tractor. Yeah, Ford, you got a backup this year. I dare you to break down. Well, here comes Cousin, so let's get to work. Can't see it. Is it you on the bottom one? Yeah. All right, we're going to probably need a little front cat with you. I know, don't use the wrench. All right, now try. Why don't we go get the right size sock? That's up to you. I'm just saying, I'm not used to using real tools. Yeah. These are real tools. These are the tools our grandfathers and people like that work with. I don't think it's going in. Well, we'll get it in there in a minute. Is the bottom one going in? I'm just, the bottom one's the one I'm working on. Well, then they put the bottom one all the way in. And when it get good and tight, we may have to bump it just a little bit to get that one to go in. Well, I don't think it's going in. Oh, wait a minute. I found, I found tires. No, that was the bottom one to do that. That don't make no sense. I think I broke it. Broke what? <laughs> oh, oh, okay, yeah. All right, I'm going to crank up, and I'm going to let it come back to this one so we can get this one in. I think I broke it. You ain't broke nothing. Everything's fine. If that's the way it goes? Yes. All right. Everything's fine. If it tightened up, you, it's good. Uh, what? How do you know it tightened up? Because it's all the way in. You good with it? Yeah, I mean, come here. It's all the way through. Look, look right down to that. Oh. See it? Okay. Okay. Yeah. You ain't broke nothing. Oh, I thought I broke it. No. You'll be fine. So right. you're going to try to make it go backwards so the top one will drop in. Mm -hmm. Okay. I had to leave it running. Is it out going in there? Or do I need to tap? Tap it. All right, now try. Then all you got to do is take your tool and all the way around whatever amount of foot pounds you think you need because I haven't got a book, so I don't know. Okay, that one's put the button in there. Yeah. Like the top and the bottom, side to side, or something like that, I think. And then what we'll do is we'll sort of... Oh, this whole mechanism is three-quarter? Yeah. Oh. Let me drive forward and backward and hit it one more time. All okay? Right. Yeah. Move your bottle. I'll
That's what we do, that Yeah, you get to keep that. Alright, let's see. Spin, we got to go forward. There. Yeah, I feel like you get right bottom. Yeah, you're right up against it. Okay, well, that's what we need so I can stick the other one in. All right, stick the other one in. And then, and, uh, then just tighten them up. Front, we need to figure out how to go in six inches. Six inches on each side. Mm -hmm. Let me tighten those lugs. And then we'll move it forward and back and hit it one more time. And then we'll have the rear end done. All right. All right, tool right there. Except for this. Hey, watch that back one and see if it's spinning. Oh, wait a minute. Play, had, yeah. Yeah, play with that tool. Okay. Oh, that looks so good. All right, I'm right. right here. See what this one does. Where it? Right there. Do the cross up. Oh shoot, I did have to get on that one. Oh, today you got different sizes. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Never seen sockets so hard to get on before. Alright, All right, up here at the front. Go. socket again okay we should have we should while we had them loose fix it where they will cross each other side by side all right i'm at the top i'm holding all right, all right. come on there we go all right bottom bottom all right. ready yeah Back to the top. The bottom went stiffer. All right, go. All right. Whew. How can you be tired? Tool did all the work. Yeah, but I had to hold the thing. Oh, is it that hard? Yeah. Heavy? Whatever the word is, name is. This one right here. Yeah. Let's hit that. And then back to that little one. What? No, not, not like that. <laughs> You should hit it. Yeah, we'll see if Go it ahead. All right, that one's look, that was snug. That one on the top still wants to turn. Let's see what this little one in the front does. Right. That one on the top scaring me. Huh? I don't know whether to hit it again or not. Let me try it forward and backwards before you do any more. All right. All right. <clears throat> Everybody's been snug. Everybody's pretty snug. That one on the top's still turning, though. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, I recognize it. You weren't on the bottom. You weren't on the bottom? Yeah. Come on. Come on. Stop. What that was about, there's a, there's a nut down here that, yeah, that one down there on the bottom is freaking me out a little bit with this impact wrench, and I do not want to break it, but it's not tight yet. Well, the store got more. Yeah, yeah but why well, I always got to be the one to break everything? Mm -hmm. Just, all right, hold your nose. We got it. What do you mean? It's gone. What's gone? The threads in there. So we do need another bolt. Bob will have to go to high and get one. Alright. Like always with farming. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> hey, hold on if you wait just a minute. I, mean, I am, I was just trying to line it up. I, I had it right there in the hole and little busky wants to tell you what, I'm gonna get smart. Stick it through there. Hold on. That's in there now. Okay, yeah. There. Alright, everybody. This needs to come up. Alright, okay. <clears throat> What'd you do with the other bolt? That's just about right. Look at that. No, no, no. it's still out too far. Huh? Come up here to the front and look, it's still out too far. Should be somewhere right in there. Uh, what do you see? Move it back that way just a tad. All right, that went. All right. To yeah. measure that, because I got a bad feeling we have actually moved it out. I think we moved it in. We moved it out. <laughs> it's confusing with those holes up at the front the visual says we moved it out see it right dead center of the back tire uh, uh you're right where's the other bolt huh? you lost it uh, i wasn't here i was up there trying to get my gloves on oh you laid it up here and hid it from me. <laughs> it ought to be out here. Uh-uh. Why not? Yeah, perfect. I'm sorry. I apologize. Man. I, I'll be good. The, huh? You got to be in charge of the nuts and lock washers back there. No, look right there. See the offset? Yeah, I know that, but I'm just... That's why we were backwards a while ago. Hold a wrench on that one right there. Ready? Yeah. Go. Didn't you have one of these fall off a couple of years ago? I don't remember. I remember seeing the tractor sitting over there in the dirt and then come back and saw it on the jack and the whole wheel was gone.
front end any burnt. Yeah, that ain't good. Mm -mm. That's going to be fun to get off of there. That cap? Yeah. I need a screwdriver. I'll be right back. Well, atypical. We get over here on this side of the tractor and uh, find a wheel bearing that is in horrible shape. Cousin, when you was wiggling that tire, do that again. That's the bearing down there on the tire. That's not the fact that the tie rod end is disconnected right now. So anyhow, I've got the uh, dust cap off of it. And dive into it and see what's going on there. Okay, folks, that's per usual. A piece. Oh, I just for a quarter. <laughs> <laughs> There's millions of them around here. You ain't lying. You get down here and put your knee down on the ground, all the Oh, it's painful. All right, as per usual, we stumbled into something messed up here on this little tractor. And the wheel was flopping all around, and we think we've got us a, what'd you call this, a redneck fix? A rig? Or ingenious solution. I like ingenious solution. That'll be fun. All right, we're going to put the smooth washer up against the bearing, and it fits, and this is going to fit, and that's going to be our spacer doodad. Uh, there's nothing wrong with the bearing. I had it out in my hand. It's a little bit worn, but this will at least get the tractor back over and to And we're a little bit worn. And we, Yeah, we're a little bit worn. This will get the tractor back over to Cousin's house. All right. I know I'll get a tractor put in and a front end alignment. All in one day. Now, what I got to figure out is that thumb wrench still out here and is it big enough? No, it's not gonna be big enough, I don't think, but it's here not. it is. That's, that's an inch, ain't it? That dude didn't come out to 15 because it just did fit this one right here while I go. That's 15, 16. Well, to set this right, would you run up there too? You know where all these are hanging? Yeah. Go you want a bigger one? one? I want one big enough to set this. this oh, so uh, now I get good with the... Yeah, it's your turn. Okay. And I really need what you're going to get. I won't fix it before you get back. I promise. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he was out here working on this. He says, I need a wrench, 9 sixteenths. I take off to go get it. And uh, he says, no, I got it. And he's taking this thing and got it loose. Mm. Should I do like a child and bring you the wrong one? No, just go and bring me the right one. It's getting kind of late. The intelligent grown up. Yeah, do the, do the intelligent grown up. Son, go get that wrench. Okay, Daddy. Bring back the wrench. Your choice. That's the one okay. I wanted. I figured if I brought two, if I brought this you. No, nah, I don't want that one. Carry it back. All right. That will do right there. Spend the pudding out of that tire like that. I ain't had no pudding lately. Right there. Get the moisture in a bit more. That's it. That's all I'm going to tighten it. Do that lateral play test. No, not that kind. Of up and down, top, bottom, like that. Oh, you down? You can get better than I can. That's good, right there. All right. Now. Oh shoot! Did we lose it? What the Carter key? Yeah, it's real shiny. It's like brand new. Yeah. Well, you had it. Ah, uh, here it is. See. And this would go, look at that. Yeah, perfect. Almost. <coughs> All right, now, we have to bend that thing somehow. Thought she was going to break it off. Uh, hopefully I can bend it and wrap it back around. The... Oh, okay. Buddy. Ow, that hurt. Where's your, uh -huh. yeah, use can... these. No, I want that screwdriver. What screwdriver? I had a flat blade screwdriver laid right here. That's it. Are we doing surgery and I'm the nurse? Uh, well, you're doing pretty good at handing me stuff. Okay. All right, I'm going to hold that like that and try to get that to go in between there. It's too big. No, there it went. Come on, babe. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. See how that great. work? Yeah, good job. You think I can do that next time? Uh-uh. Why not? Because you're doing a better job than I do. I'm, I'm a nurse. <laughs> you're the doctor. You, you're the one getting $50,000 50, $50, a minute. What are you going to do? Get it off? Yeah, I don't want it in there. Okay. Well, right. I ain't hurting. It's just grass. Yeah, well, <laughs> we still don't want it in beside the patient. Right, that <coughs> Why it'll grow to him? There, like that. What's wrong with the patient anyway? He has a bad <laughs> thing about it. Yeah, I ain't gonna see what I thought. All right, let's see now. The hammer's really too big, but I'm gonna try it in here. <laughs> what? <laughs> 
<laughs> Hammer's way too big for what I'm doing, but you see how I got that yeah, one beat back down? Yeah, you did good, now do the other one. Really? Yeah. I bet you can do it. Is that even broke on that thing? It's bent a little bit. No, I'm talking about your, your fire. Uh, yeah, it's bent just a little bit. But no, it's not, you got a piece gone. It's bent a little bit. Oh, okay. It's, it's, it's dark, not, I can't see. Well, it's not throw away. Now, if you hadn't stepped on it and smashed it full of grit, there you go, give me that. Really? Yeah, man, got some grit in you, man. Oh, please go on, please go on. What's going on? You got a big it, say go, get on. You been giving me a thought. Well, there it is, finished. A little 1020 with the wheels set in to actually match uh, the Ford tractor. Ran into some aggravations. That uh, wheel bearing right over there, that one was in bad shape. And with that one being as bad as it was, I said, cousin, let's jack this one back up and look at it. And sure enough, it was in bad shape and it was missing a washer. So, uh, took the time to make something to make it better but highly recommend cousin get these hubs off of here sometime and get in there and see what the races look like uh, they're adjusted and tight enough but that's done and uh hopefully let's see i think today's day's the sixth I'm, i think it's thursday thursday the sixth not sure but uh it's thir hey thank you for that yeah. i i can never remember what day it is when i'm trying to video something well, it's actually night time now yeah what time is it almost 11 almost 11 yeah well we had fun we got to play yeah. with all sorts of ratchets and wrenches and right. impact thingamabobs i've seen you off and have it broke loose when you got back <laughs> yeah <laughs> <laughs> but it's done and uh just remember john Deere, nothing's never tight it's easy to take off <laughs> yeah, that struck me funny. The camera won't run, and your cousin's over here spinning things off with his fingers and saying, that must be one you tightened. Mm -hmm. and, and and then he's talking about, yeah, John Deere's easy to work on. You don't need tools. You just spin it off with your finger. It's a good thing we jumped on this and went through it because the things that we found that were like that, you know, could have been a real hassle, real problem. You're out there trying to get work done. and We'll fall off. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've seen that happen many times. <laughs> real aggravating. Yeah. Especially if it's a disc and it, and it falls in the dirt. Well, cooks the races on. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I was just breathing. I'm reminiscing from the past. Yeah. I, well, I remember. See, I was over there by the pond, and this tractor was sitting over there, missing the front wheel. Uh, and, and the first time I saw it, the, the axle was in the in the dirt, and I went by it and come back by a couple hours later, and there was a jack under it, and it's still missing the wheel. And then I come back, and the tractor was gone. So. I mean, that was one of your adventures. Of, I guess so. I just I don't remember. Well, a lot of years of that little tractor being here. That thing's been here. People made a video uh, last year during planting season, cousin, on this little tractor planting the Allen field. The title of the video is Memories. Yeah. Um, and I was talking about how long this little tractor has been here. Didn't that little tractor come here in 1965? 65 or 66. It's, yeah, 65. You and I, when we were kids and this was a tobacco farm and mm -hmm. we were trucking tobacco from the field to, right. to the barns we'd yeah. get it rushing over to the two tractors every morning and that was the fun one to drive it had power steering and that was old ford gas burner eight eight in ford <laughs> i remember not fun to drive <laughs> no don't stop don't turn and you had to sit in and stand on the brakes if you were sitting on the hill because the tractor there was no way you could not sit in the seat and hold the brake you had to literally stand on the brakes to hold it on the hill until the guys passed by prime and then once they passed by you go over the hill then you was all right i remember all that yeah well that was because we was a little young and yeah, we were little guys we, we weigh 45 60 pounds yeah, or something, something like, like that yeah yeah i remember standing up on the brake trying to hold it and i wish for the life of me i could remember that old 630 430 430 john deere 430 you got to drive over me yeah that one got away from me mm -hmm. and uh I think you were actually on that little tractor right there. It could have been. When uh, the 430 got away from me, the clutch was so hard to press in. And I was literally climbing up the back tires of that tractor, and Scott's sitting there 
screaming something, shaking his fist at me like that was going to stop it all. <laughs> yeah. I was trying to use my power, man. It just didn't work. But we're still here, so yeah. we both survived it. It was an event. And yeah. I got off the tractor and ran around behind the barn all upset, and Scott's daddy told me to get back up on that tractor and, and drive it. And yeah. So I did. Yeah. You fall off a horse, you get back on it. But uh, just some memories of the farm here. Every time I look at that little tractor, wherever it's sitting on this place, I start having them childhood memories again. Yeah, were good memories. Well, cousin. Yes, sir. I'm tired. I am too. I got to go home, go to bed, so I can go to work tomorrow. Yay. Uh, Thank you. You called a man about the seed. I'm going down there and, and pick up a few bags. I might do something next week. If you got any inclination of wanting to do something this weekend, text me and let me know what you decide, and Thank I'll you. pick them up and bring them home to you. All right. Thank you. God bless everybody watching this. Peace unto you all. Amen. Bye, y'all. Bye.